Now, a day after Chinese President Xi Jinping's speech at the World Health Assembly, U.S. President Donald Trump lashes out against both the World Health Organization and China, calling the United Nations health body China's puppet. Now, before we tell you more, listen in. And I think they've done a uh, very sad job in the last period of time. And again, the United States uh, pays them $450 million a year. China pays them $38 million a year. And they're a puppet of China. They're uh, China-centric, to put it nicer, but they're a puppet of China. The U.S. president was seen emphasizing the fact that the U.S. was the largest contributor financially to the WHO, paying around $450 million annually to the body, compared to China's contribution of around $38 million every year. President Trump even suggested that this $450 million could come down to just about 40, suggesting that the U.S. may permanently slash funding to the U.N. health body. Now, the president's statements come as the WHO is holding its first virtual assembly with 194 member states. But this wasn't the only attack against the organization. Earlier, the U.S. health secretary addressed this very assembly, taking a dig at one particular member state. While there are no guesses on who that is, his scathing remarks on both China and the WHO came just after countries around the world pledged more support to the body. Now, this is not the first time the U.S. has blamed the body for not taking enough action to control this pandemic. In April, the U.S. even suspended funding to the WHO for severely mismanaging the spread of the virus, as they said.